This first exercise is about using Markdown to create pretty text that we can use for keeping notes throughout the course. So what we've got here is a cell, and we can see it's a cell because of this highlighted blue bar here. And if we double click the cell, we can able to, we're able to go into the code mode. That's kind of all the information behind what we saw. So there's lots going on here, but the key things to note are that we can use hashes to create headers. So if I render the cell, you can see it's a nice header. And we can use numbers, periods, and spaces like this to create numbered lists. We can use asterisks and spaces to create bulleted lists like this. And we can also use asterisks uh, to create bold and italic text. And we can use what's called a grave accent, which is this kind of reverse apostrophe to highlight what code looks like. And that looks like this. And you'll see that a lot throughout the course. <laughs> throughout the course, we really recommend that you take the time to make your own markdown cells uh, and to include information that you found useful or maybe things that you didn't understand first time around.